In this video, I'm going to show you how to turn any product image into a viral Facebook or Instagram video ad. I will show you how to do that step by step and through all the process we are going to use AI. Only AI. So let's get started. The first step you should start with is to find good video or good videos in order to get inspired from. And the best place to do this research is the Facebook ads library. In here, I need you to choose first a country. You can go with all, then select all ads. And in here, put the name of your main competitors or maybe other brands in your niche or similar niches. The idea is to find good ads to get inspired from. So search for your competitors or even you can type keywords related to your product and to your niche. And usually I find it's better to search for a specific brand. Since the product I'm going to create a video around and it's actually a virtual product is a beverage that's going to substitute coffee. I'm going to research mud water because they are my main competitors. So I will choose in here mud water and now I will be able to see all the active ads from mud water. In here I need you to scroll and I need you to preview these ads and find the ones that you like and you think are aligned with your brand or with what you have in mind. You can scroll down, see what you can actually create using AI because some videos can be created using AI or they won't look as good as if they are real like for example the ones with the real people so scroll down in here search for ads see what might work for your brand and product and once you find the video that you like now it's the time to download this video in order to be able to extract the script and give the script back to ChatGPT to create a similar script for your product let's do this step by step so our next step would be to download the ad that we liked and in here, we are going to use the default browser uh, options. We are not going to use any Chrome extension or any paid tool. I just need you, let's say, for example, this is the video that you liked. I just need you to right click and click on inspect. Now you would need to search for something similar to this. And this is where you will find this link. As you can see, this is the link of the video. I will double click on this link and just simply copy it. And this is going to work, by the way, whether you have a Mac or a window. I will copy this link and open a new tab and simply paste the link in here. And now I have my video. In order to save this video, I just need to right click and click save video as, and it will be downloaded to my desktop or to my PC. Once this is done, our next step is to extract the script. And in order to do that, we are going to use CupCat. If you don't already have CupCat installed on your laptop, I highly recommend you to do so now. It's very useful and we are going to create amazing videos using it. So from here, I will click on create project. I will add the video that I have just downloaded. So I will scroll and add the video add. I will select the video I just downloaded. I will move it in here. And now I want you to click here on text and go to uh, auto captions and click on generate. So basically we are generating the captions of this video because it has a voiceover. This is going to be done automatically. It takes few seconds and that's it. Once this is done, we are going to extract this script. So in here, I want you to go to file, export, and instead of exporting a video or an audio, you scroll down and you export a caption and you click on export. Let's click on OK. And let me show you the result. You click on open folder and this is the script as you can see it's in here now you can simply copy and paste the script into chat gpt and this is going to be actually our next step the next thing i did and it's actually super simple was to take the script and ask chat gpt to rewrite the script so it works for my product so in here i told chat gpt this is the script i already have i pasted the script and i gave chat gpt more information about my product you can even ask chat gpt to write this information about your product or write a summary about it so it knows how to tweak the script to work best for you and in here you will see the result it turned out to be a little bit long so i asked chat gpt to make it 30 seconds long and as you can see this is the result now the next step would be to create the images for this video then turn these images into videos so in the next step in here i gave chat gpt the script and i asked chat gpt to create the visual storyboard for this video 
And as you can see, ChatGPT created the storyboard. So what you can do is you can tell ChatGPT what you are actually doing. In my case, I want to turn the script into images and turn these images into videos. So in here, I asked ChatGPT to break the script into parts, into scenes. And as you can see, I have these scenes in here. Then I asked ChatGPT to create the prompt to create an image for each of these scenes. And ChatGPT returned a list of prompts. For each image, I have one prompt. And all I need to do now is to copy these prompts into ChatGPT and create these images. I have tweaked a little bit that prompt, asked ChatGPT about special things in order to get my final result. Make sure to do this small alternation to ensure that the results that you will get are the best possible. Once I had the prompts ready, all I needed to do was to copy and paste these prompts into ChatGPT to create my images and you just need to do it one image at a time and that's it. I've done that in the same chat to make sure that the images look alike. So this is the prompt. I have uploaded the product shot and this was the first result. And as you can see, I've done this repetitively. In here, for example, the image was landscape. I wanted to be vertical. So I asked ChatGPT to fix this. Then I continued creating the images one after the other. For sure, you can tweak the prompts if you want to create something new or if you want to be more creative and decide the scenes that you want to have in your video, you can also do that. But I'm trying to do everything using AI to show you how simple it can be. So after creating all of these images, what I needed to do next is to create the prompts to turn them into videos. In order to create the prompts that I will be using on Kling.ai to turn each of these images into video, I have used ChatGPT and I've done the following. I uploaded all my images and I told ChatGPT that I want to turn these images into videos using Kling.ai and ChatGPT returned the prompts. I could have spent some time improving these prompts a little bit, maybe adding some details, but, but also I was very lazy and I didn't do any of these things. I simply copied and pasted these prompts one at a time to Kling.ai with the right image and got the videos I want for my ad. So here I am inside of Kling.ai and as you can see, I had all of these videos created. So this is an example. And this is another example. It's even created with voice. In order to create a video like this one, all you need to do is to simply upload your image and in here paste the prompt from ChatGPT. And that's it. Let's look at the videos I've created and uh, we will discuss them a little bit and I'm pretty sure you can even create better than them. So this is a second image, a second video. I might not, not actually use this one. It looks very AI. Let's look at this one. This is actually a very good one for ads. Let's look at this one. This is also a very good one. Now I've created some additional content, but this time more like lifestyle content. So let's look at it. And here is the final one. So for example, in this video, the bottle looks very big. I should have adjusted the image at the beginning and made the bottle smaller on ChatGPT, turning it out into a video in here. This, these are the small things or the small details that you should be taking care of while creating your video. But I was so lazy while creating this one just to show you how easy and straightforward it can be. So now that I have all of these videos, I'm going to turn them into a video ad also using CupCat. So now we have our small clips ready. We need to do the voiceover in order to create our full video. And in order to create the voiceover, either you record the voice yourself or you can use CupCat to do this for you. From your CupCat dashboard in here, start a new project and click on text, then add a new text. In order for this feature to work, you need to be on CupCat Pro and you need to take small chunks of your script. You can't copy and paste the full script in here because it doesn't work for a text longer than 500 characters. So I'm going to paste all my script and remove a big part of it. So I will remove this part and just keep the first part. 
Also in here, I will, let me just make it a little bit smaller. So this is my first, the first part of my script, as you can see. And I will change this because I don't think that CapCut will understand that this means number one. So I will go in here and write in here number one. All you need to do now is to select this text and in here to choose text to speech and you can preview the different speeches or the different voices in here before deciding to generate one of them. So let's preview for example this one. Three reasons Nuva Coco isn't like any drink you've tried before. So if you decided to use this one, all you need to do is to click on generate speech. And CupCat would be generating the audio of this first part. And as you can see, this is the audio in here. Let's play it to preview it together. Three reasons Nuva Coco isn't like any drink you've tried before. Number one, no caffeine crash. Coffee and energy drinks spike you up, then drop you hard. Nuva gives you smooth, steady energy without the jitters. You can play around with the different audio options provided to find something that maybe looks more natural or feels more natural. It's up to you. Or you can use this one, which is pretty common in ads and over social media. Or you can always record the audio yourself in order to make the video look even more natural. Once you have all your voiceover, you just need to start building up your video by adding the scenes into your video. So you have already the storyboard from ChatGPT. All you need basically is to add these videos in here. So you click here on add media. I'm going to import all the videos that I have worked on, then put them in here. Once you have these videos in here, you just need to start adding them to the timeline to create your video. So let's say, for example, I will start with this uh, scene in here. You can always go back to the storyboard if you want to make sure that these uh, images match the script. So let's say, for example, I'm going to take this one and just I'm going to show you a small clip of how this is going to look like. So let me go at the beginning. Three reasons Nuva Coco isn't like any drink you've tried before. Number one, no caffeine crash. Coffee and energy drinks spike you up. So this is just a small example of how we can start creating this video. You can continue by creating the other audio parts and adding the videos to them in order to have your full video ad. I worked a little bit more on this video. I've generated the full voiceover using the text-to-speech feature from CupCat. I've added the videos that I have created using Clink.ai. And now I have this first draft of the video ad. It's not perfect. It could have been way, way better if I wasn't very lazy and if I focused more on the images and videos that I'm creating. But I wanted to show you how quickly you can end up with a video ad using AI. So as you can see, this is the final result. I'm going to show it. And once you finish doing it here, actually also in CapCut, you can add subtitles, you can add the music and make sure that your video is as good as it could be. So let's go to the full preview and watch the final result. Three reasons Nuva Coco isn't like any drink you've tried before. Number one, no caffeine crash. Coffee and energy drinks spike you up, then drop you hard. Nuva gives you smooth, Steady energy without the jitters. Number two, real ingredients, all in real doses, no fake flavors, no fillers. Number three, Nuva boosts focus, calm, and clarity. So you can power through your day without burning out. Now, before finishing, here are some small recommendations I need you to keep in mind. While creating your video ad, you need to focus as much as possible on making the flow natural. So after creating the script using ChatGPT, make sure to read it, make sure to tweak it if you have something in mind. And while you are creating the images and the video clips, make sure to do the same. With ChatGPT, you are basically creating those images for free if you have a pro plan. And with Clink.ai, you pay as you go. So be cautious, create good clips and turn them out all into a real nice video for your ad. 
now using AI, as you can see, you can create video ads for your products just out of a product shot and that's it. Well, yes, those ads are not perfect. And maybe if there is a human that's actually filming the product, the ads will look better, but they are a very good start. And learning how to use this tool to create ads for you and for your brand is super important because soon enough, these videos are going to look super natural. And now we are seeing a lot of video ads being created by AI and they are performing very well, although they don't look 100% natural and they look like AI made. People are not minding seeing them. They are not minding buying from an AI ad. So you have no excuse of not learning how to use these tools and create these videos for your products. I hope this video will help you to create video ads easily. And I hope that throughout this video, you have learned a lot of new skills that will help you to improve your content creation process. Thank you so much for watching this video and see you in the next one.